Onivia, League of Legends highlights. The Gwen, yeah. I'm absolutely fine with this. I love it as well because now you've got the Lee Sin in the jungle that's going to augment. Uh, using augment when there's a victory in the game is an awkward thing to do. However, it is going to augment the lanes with a bit of physical and misty game here today as uh, Keen losing a bunch of his health bar. Not going to be able to get all the snips onto Khan there as we can see. Leo. Shoemaker and Barrow are making their way up. Yep, Leo's going to go back, but so it is away. a little bit too late as yeah. Malrong, he's got a long range equalized, but he's going to get hooked. Fly now potentially in trouble as the land is taken by the victor. Canyon flashes on forward. He's not a jungler, he's been unleashed, doesn't need to be there for the smite as the Eye of the Herald goes down, and I think it was secured by Afrika, but now... I'll tell you that much. He's got one of those new tents with a phone charger in it. Oh yeah, that's gonna be a face breaker, and Showstopper comes in. Keen, yep, the Mist ain't gonna do anything to help you there, and patience pays off for Malrong <laughs> this time. So they grab their second kill uh, this season. The set versus uh, Gwen has been very Gwen favored thus far, uh, but Khan seems very, very comfy, of course, you know. Different situations happening around the map, and that gank are going to help. But even yeah. in the early stage, it was uh, doing all right. I Earth, like the Wind and Fire comes in as now, as I give Khan the credit, he is uh, just going to try and bait Keen in. Has the Haymaker, of course. Not going to get the biggest shield, as there's the Equalizer, and Khan's just going to be able to walk on down it. Let's see whether Malrung's going to be able to lock this one up. Khan is in a fair bit of danger, actually, as there's a flash. The face breaker comes in and he just gets popped. I, don't, I could see it coming. However, it is still a one for one in the end, and assists make it work. Need those Mountain Drakes to come through as Dom Juan Kia, and with Afrika already having this much of a Drake lead, I like their position in this game quite a lot, considering they also have the victory. Well, they're going to lose this top out of turret, so for Dom Juan Kia, it's worth even more, so maybe it wasn't even a silly play. Mini stun into the wall, into just dead, as Khan is going to stride break all over the Lee Sin. In Canyon position right now, like we mentioned, stride breaker is done. Also building towards what is potentially a Sterix and has himself the execution is calling to make sure that this Gwen is going to be taken care of if he does. Khan is walking on a ward. Dread has discovered him. Khan knows that the jig is up, but he's not going to get closed in on just yet. That Stride Breaker also showstopper as well. The hook is going to connect onto Canyon. He does manage to get the big old shield. And the turnaround is too good. Showmaker will pick up the kill onto Keen, and that is exactly who Afrika did not want to lose. True Shot Barrage lands onto a couple, softening up the members of Afrika Freaks, and it looks like they are just going to give up this one as Dread. No, not going to quite find it. Sonic Wave going to need another buff for that one to land, <laughs> as the Drake is going to reset. Someone here are going to pick it up and continue their oh, advance God. forward, as that's going to help Showmaker a lot. He is down by quite a lot gravity of gravity field. But he's going to hop back into his mist and have a good time as the mid lane outer turret is going to fall. Solar Flare connects as Showmaker is just going to get onto this turret. Make sure he takes that one down as, oh, that piercing arrow. I thought the, uh, or commitment. Maybe we just say like, this is like Sh Showmaker is just going to try and be the next perks who then decided to renege. However, no stopwatch and now, I'm on Kira looking for a Baron. Exactly, you end up pushing away that hard and there's no Zonias and Fly has to back. Like, you could start this Baron at this point. Well, it is going down very, very quickly as well as Barrel with the Eclipse is going to keep himself alive. Malrong will see how well he's going to have his Smite finger prepped as in goes Keen. Now there's the showstopper again, completely out of his circle. And Dom Juan Kia just trashing this team fight. Keen fights one in the back line as Dread's getting taken down low. The Gwen's not going to survive. Showmaker grabs a triple kill. And now it's just Leo against the world trying to land some poke, but it ain't going to stop this Baron from being taken down. Nope, it's going to be an easy Baron now, and guess what? They have a Mountain Drake up as well. Leo is not going to be able to try to sneak that one underneath Don Juan Kia's nose by himself, so this should be double objective. At the greatest jungle player of all time? Exactly! Should Canyon be benched, question mark? Now you've got the young man <laughs> mechanics, and I think Malrong's actually older than Canyon, so never mind. That doesn't actually matter, but Malrong has certainly always been very aggressive in the jungle, and cool and stuff like that, but I don't know. Gordon <laughs> actually somehow still kills Ruler with, when there's no hope. <laughs> yep, yep. But in this case, it's Dread who's just like sitting back using Qs to try to kill minions. Um, and 
This is the second game today, I feel, in terms of where the lead is, what the conditions are, and, and how difficult it is for a freak to try to crack through. Yep. Again, oh, up the key. Oh, dear. Showmaker is just free hitting with his Mystic Shots. That is a solar flare that happened in this game, as there's the equalizer. <laughs> and Lehens is going to get popped. He goes through the box, though, and the flash is going to be good. Kick out there is Dread. That was a pretty cool disengage play, I'm not going to lie. And there's the flash over from Canyon. Can he get in there? Ults over the wall. But Lehens, he's got a Blast Cone prepared, and somehow, Afrika are playing this really cool game of tag, and it's only Lehens so far that is going to get taken down. Fly is going to get deep into enemy territory before teleporting to safety. As Dumb One Kia, with two seconds on the Baron, may just decide that they don't want to continue playing hide and seek, and maybe the Baron is what the, is going to be on their mind instead. But. They do Dredd. not want to give away this mountain, Drake. Dread's coming in here, and Khan's here to respond. I don't think this is going to work out, Afrika. Good try, though. Yeah, it was cute, thinking that the Baron was being taken, and honestly, I don't blame them, as sometimes you need some of these desperation plays. It is going to be the Mountain Soul there. Khan's going to flash over the wall, as now Showmaker has discovered Keen. That's another Solar Flare, and the Equalize is pretty good. But Afrika, I think they're just going to die, regardless of what had happened there, because they were on the wrong side of the map without much of a hope. That's a Double kill for Showmaker as well on his Ezreal. Just patting them stats as he grabs spotted. I mean, you're, you just don't have any options. Uh, you're at the end of the book. There's no pages left to turn. Well, we're going for it as good by Mr. Leo. You are not the one that wanted to be, sta wanted to be standing in that brush, and the Baron is going to very comfortably be taken here by Malrong, who has not died in any game played on the LCK stage for Dom One Kia ever. You know, I mean, he was very close to the perfect game. Uh, Wait, actually, no, he did die. Yeah, never mind. He was very close. Uh, I take it all back. Okay, uh, he's only died once. In their suffering. As that's the equalizer. Thankfully, the team fighters saved me from that almost lie that I said on the broadcast, as Gwen is just going to be taken out. Beryl is going to be the sacrifice. The snips come in, and my goodness, Canyon might be the best Gwen in this game, as he just slices them all up. The Viego working out for Damwon Kia. They snowballed this from very early on. Showmaker finishes off with a 7-0 for Ezreal after a bit of a horror when it came to the early game as everyone's just partying as gold people on the fountain. And Damwon Kia will walk away with the win. And we will all walk away not really knowing that much more. Though we certainly...